Hey everyone, we are here playing Beoken's uh, Fiery Info Sync. Find ourselves up against Smoke. Could be an interesting matchup. We don't have ice, but we do have breaking news early. So, what to do, what to do. Um, I think I'll keep it and hope I draw nice. If I don't, I'll just score the breaking news. And we'll see if they're on Siphon, <laughs> as many Smokes seem to be. So, no, we just find another breaking news. So instead, I think we just go with this. Scored it really quickly, and hopefully we don't lose the other one. At least we talked down to three credits, so siphon isn't amazing value, and this isn't the deck you want to play. You want to keep tags against either, so we'll see how that goes. Uh, they're going to come in hand. They could hit boom, or they could hit breaking news. Neither of which are great for us, but now they know what we're on. Gonna come for R and D. Trash and Jackson, fair enough. Going aggressive, going aggressive, nice and early. And they get the fifteen minutes, but that's kind of the worst one for them. Uh, we get a turnpike, which I like. I think I'll put this on R and D and sweeps. Possibly should have kept the sweeps in hand. Just well, actually, I should definitely have because now I've just looked at their hand size. Well, that was silly. Anyway. So not only have we left breaking news more exposed, but we didn't get much money out of it. So that was ridiculous. Make sure you're aware of your surroundings when uh, when making plays. Pop-up window is great for us, and a kitty. So our hand is getting a little less good than we would have liked. Do you want to see this SMC getting used sooner rather than later, really? Desperado. I was not expecting that. But at least we're pretty sure then that they're not playing Siphon or something like that. We do want to make a lot of runs. We're okay with that because at the moment we're looking at Pop-Up and Turnpike, both of which are really, really good for us. So, I think it was a quick consultation with the their deck. So a land tag will cost them more to remove, which is really good. Gotta love sync. And it's setting them up for a closed account as or a hard hitting news, I should say. Two more cats in the deck. Plus if they steal a three pointer we have exchange, good to go. They are keeping their tag. So now the quantum predicted model would be a great hit for us. Nope, just hard hitting news. Okay, well, they know this is coming anyway. So they remove the tag. We can easily hard hitting news, which seems good. We could exchange, but we could just wait a little while which I think is also perfectly acceptable. So let's draw and play two. Observe and destroy. Oh, that's going to be good against Desperado. Let's do this and do this. So with four tags, they're more than likely permanently tagged. We can install the quantum predictor model if we want. Uh, Observe and Destroy would be pretty good to trash Desperado. They've paid a lot of influence for it. Now the only thing is, it does remove a tag. So we can afford to put out the kitty. And um, we can put this on archives. And observe and destroy, remove a tag. Yeah, I'm not, not completely opposed to that. Because again, they don't have much to... Actually, we can hold on to the kitty. So let's draw and play two. So, put this on... Uh, 
Where do we want this? I suppose HQ, no, RNG is where they're more likely to go, right? Especially if they stop caring about tags. And it's trash. Uh, let's go Desperado. Next turn, we can get the other breaking news scored. We'll be able to swap it in pretty quick time. Hmm, fan site, that's not great for us. Okay, well, we can deal with all of this. So they will get a fan site scored. And now we ought to do the swap soon. Plus, we have Jackson, so we'll try and get back Jackson. Boom. And maybe economy. Refractor comes in, but they are giving us money. So, they're going to go poor, which means close counts isn't all that effective. But they can't trash Jackson. They could give us an extra point. So we're hoping they hit the quantity predictive here. There we go. That will do nicely. And top hat. Interesting. It's a card that I misread the first time I saw it, and is much worse now. <laughs> NFD is kind of whatever at the moment. Um, they don't have the money to afford it. They're playing mostly on stealth, so yeah. I think we draw, install Jackson, exchange. Putting us up to five. So if they don't get much money, and in fact we can close accounts them as well. Resistor could also be good. Let's draw two. If we can find the boom, we end it. Nope. This time we get a sweeps for a better value. And we will put the turnpike on HQ. So, they have removed enough tags not to be boomed. Archangel, less good now, we still have Refractor. I think we install Advanced this behind Resistor. And I don't know if there's much they can do about that with so little money. We'll see. But I think this could be... Could be the end for them. Because even if they get through here, they still need the money or a film critic down. And we can still afford to res everything here. NEPD is going to close it out. So not quite how this deck is supposed to function, but I uh, did the job. Observe and Destroy is a really good card. Uh, definitely slowed them down a lot, and the early hard hitting news out of sync is just absolutely brutal. So, hope you enjoyed. Definitely give this deck a try. There's a reason it took second at Worlds. 
And even though people are t teching against tags, it is still really, really good.